Hello, good evening. Hello. How are you today? I'm good. Yes. Oh, how was your study? Okay, can you hear me? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so I will share my screen to you. So last meeting, we discussed about the grammar, right? So now let's move on to our hmm, listening. Okay, so before that, what have you remember about grammar? About, it's about much, many. <laughs> yes, we have much, many, few, a little, right? So that is the uncountable nouns. And the, what is that? Plural nouns, am I right? So the quantity and the, um, the number, right? Okay. okay. So now this time, let's move on to listening. So, mm, listening. So let's try if. Okay. Okay. Can you see my slide already? Okay. Did you see it? Yeah. So please read. No, I cannot read. Listening, advertising. Advertising, again, advertising. Advertising. So what is that? I can predict what I'm going to hear, right? So now we have this. So let's move on first with by vocabulary. So what is that? Direction. Okay, direction. so direction. What have you really understand about direction? Um, West? Direction, North? yeah. What do you mean West? by direction? I cannot know. Uh -huh. Okay, go, please read. Go, please read the meaning of the direction. No general position a person or to move a point to what? Yes. So, just... Bear in your mind that direction is that is the thing that um where you will go. Okay, for example, what way you like to go, so that is the direction. So in our life we have also our direction, right? Okay, the possession of a person, the direction on it, and the thing moves. Where is the direction on it? Then point towards, right? So narrate, what have you understand about narrate? What have you understand about narrate? Want to know? No. Okay, so narrate is to tell a story. Okay, so can you see um that um for example a drama? Okay, before there are two person who got a conversation, there is first to narrate what happened to the story. For example, okay, the person is reading the title of the story and then, okay, I will give you, 
birthday. In a wonderful place, there is a king and a princess. They live in a castle. So that is the the one who narrate the story. So they called us the narrator. Okay. So next, how about the complain? A complain. What tell is a story. That? Complain. I don't know. Yes, a complaint is, which is, okay, please read it. To say that you are annoyed, unhappy, or not satisfied about somebody's thing. Okay, so meaning that, for example, complain. So, example, your mom buy you a clothes, and then you don't like it. So, what will you do? You are complaining to your mom, right? Mom, I don't like this kind of color of the t-shirt. Why you buy for me like this? Okay, it is already complaining to something. Okay, so many, you are not, you are unhappy on that thing. For example, okay, you eat food in the restaurant, right? And then the food is not so delicious. So you are not satisfied on it. So you always complaining to something, right? Okay, or something um to someone that you annoyed. Okay. So persuade, what is that? Okay. Okay, go. To make somebody do something by giving them good reason for doing it. <clears throat> to make somebody to do something by giving them good reason for doing it. Okay, first word is that. Okay. You say to someone, okay, that he must do a good job right why because on what she do or he do there is a good reason in it okay so meaning you are always appreciating appreciating to someone to make somebody do something by giving them good reason for doing it so you will ask to do to everybody or somebody to do it but there is a good reason in it, okay? So, for example, okay. your mom um, asked you to do, um, what is that? Anything that uh, you think that that is not good for you, but your mom know, knows best, right? So, she make you to do that because uh, there is a good reason why you must do it okay so organic meaning organic organic product or practice without using artificial chemical see what do you mean by organic that or is Without all practice, without okay. using artificial, without chemical. any chemical, right? So, unorganic is just like in the city, we cannot see an organic. Why? Because there are already artificial chemicals in every plant. Well, if that is in the, um, for example, in the, what is that? In the village or something, just like, uh, in a small town, okay, if there is an area where is a vacant plant and a thing, so sometimes they are not using for artificial chemicals. Why? Because one reason is they cannot afford because artificial chemicals is that is a very expensive now the expensive nowadays. So if the people are poor. So, what do you think? They only use the organic, okay? The fertilizer of some animals, okay? But in the city, we are not 
um, sure they will use organic. Why? Because there is no animals in the city, right? The fertilizer they will buy in the another town because only in the town they can see the fertilizer. So that is why organic is that is natural. Okay. So whole meal. What is whole meal? Uh, bread of flour contains the whole grains of wheat, uh, including the husk. Okay, so that is a whole grains of wheat, right? We can use that, uh, just like a cereal. Okay, so next executive. A person who has an important job as a manager of a company or an organization. Yes, executive is a person who has an important job as a manager of a company or an organization. So meaning the executive is they have a big role in the company, right? Okay, next, confuse. What is confused? To make somebody unable to think clearly or understand. Yes, confused is to make unable to think clearly or understand at So meaning. So for example, you are confused on what you think. Okay, so you, you are confused why your mom tell you like that why your mom do that or why your father do that. So you are very confused of everything on what they are doing, on what also they think, or you are confused with yourself why you have overthink something, all right? So next, the session. I know you know it. What is the session? Okay, go. This isn't a choice or judgment that you make after thinking, talking about what is the best thing to do. Okay, a choice or judgment that you make after thinking. So you have, we have our own decision, right? Every one of us, we have a decision, right? And already what is your decision, your plan, on what you are going to do. Okay, today you must study, play games, or whatever. So, you decision already with yourself, right? So, solve. <laughs> what is a solve? Uh, so, find a way to deal with a problem. Yeah, so what is that? So meaning if you have a big problem and then you will find a way everything. So you are solving with your problem, right? You solve in a simple way so that your problem will be okay. To solve, okay. Next, what is that convenient? Hmm. Useful, easy, or quick to do, not causing problem. Yes, so convenient. So useful, easy, or quick to do, not causing problem. So what do you mean by that? It is easy to yes. what to do or something just like um, no errors, okay, appear or just in a smooth way, right? So that is a thing that, that is very useful, that is very convenient. For example, oh, I am very, uh, it, it, this restaurant is very convenient for all the customers that they eat at the restaurant, right? So that is easy to eat in the restaurant, okay? Um, the, what is that, the employee are quick to do, to serve 
the foods, right? That is very convenient. So, for example, uh, that, that's why it is called convenience store. Why? Because you easily buy something. You pick something that what you want in that store. So, that is what we call convenience store. Okay? So, it is easy. That is very useful. And that is really quick to do it, right? So, what is that? Next. You can ask question to me, okay? Don't be shy if you can't really understand. And also, please tell me if I am very fast for you. Okay, that. Okay. Okay, next, that. What is that? Bearable. What do you mean by bearable? A person or thing that is bearable can be accepted or dealt with. Yes, a person or thing that is bearable can be accepted or dealt with. So meaning it is very easy to deal to someone, right? A thing or any a person. So there is a bear. Bear meaning bearable. So that is you bear it. Okay? It is very acceptable for everything. Okay? Next. Okay. And variable. Uh, unbearable to painful, annoying, or a person to deal with, to deal with, or accept. So, what is that? Too painful. Annoying or unpleasant to deal with or, okay, that is what? Different with the bearable, right? That is synonym with the um, bearable. So that is annoying to painful and pleasant. So it is not very useful, right? Okay. Okay, so do the slogan cookies. Hi, let's move on. Can you watch this TV advertising? slogan with their products for example the ultimate driving machine so i will give you that is a credit card okay please move to number two until number eight it's your turn okay do <laughs> What is the number two? Please read it. Um, because I'm what it. Yes, because I'm worth it. What is that? Yes. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, number three, finger linking good. Hmm. Oh, a computer? Yeah. A computer. Okay, just try. Just do it. But I don't know. Okay, for example, the ultimate driving machine. So, that is number four, number four. Uh, 
Okay, number one, the ultimate driving machine. So we, okay, what kind of machine that we can drive that is only a car, right? Because I'm worth it. What do you mean by that? So worth that is that is a hair products. It's very worth. Like a finger linking good. So fast food. Finger linking good is we can see that in the KFC. Okay. Okay, number four. Just do it. Sports clothes. Just do it. We can see that in the, um, just like in the night. Just do it. That is the night, right? That is the Don't sports leave. clothes. Don't leave home without that. Don't leave home without it. Just please, just think. That is a credit card. Six. It's good to talk. That a is a. Network? Yes, a phone network. Melts in your mouth, not in your hands. Melts in your mouth, not in your hands. That is a sweet. Think different. Number eight. Think different. That is a computer. Please remember this kind of slogan. It can help you, right? Okay, if you can okay. see that. Yeah. Okay, listen to the advert and complete this phrases. Write one. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay, I will answer and then you will please read that on me. Number one, please read. Why not try hot way new organic bread? Yes, number two. It's perfect for sandwich. Number two, what is that? It's perfect for sandwich and toast. Yes, number three. As for hot way. Organic warm wheel. Number four. Start the day with hot way. Okay, so let's move on to the transcript, right? I am your mom. Okay, your toast ready. Okay. Again, but it it hit brown, but I hit brown bread. Just try it. Do I have to? Okay, just one bit. Mm, not bad. It tastes like white bread. I know, but it's one hundred percent organic whole meal. Really well. It tastes great. Okay, read the voice over it. Do you want the goodness of brown bread but the taste of white bread? Why don't you try hot one new organic bread? It baked from 100% wholemeal flour with a delicious natural taste. It's perfect for sandwiches and toast. And it gives kids the energy they need for a busy day. Add a hot away organic wholemeal, delicious and convenient food. Oh, Saturday with hardware. Okay, is it a good advert in your opinion? Why or why not? What do you think? In your own opinion, there's no mistake on it. Is it a good advert? Yes or no? Okay, another. Is it aimed at children or adults? What do you think? Hmm. Okay, here. But I hit brown bread. 
your toast ready. So the, uh, our advertise is about the bread, the toast bread. Okay. So is it a good advert in your opinion? What do you think? Mm, yeah. And it is aimed at children or adults. What do you think? Hmm? Hmm. 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 Just think it wisely. So here, okay, so let's repeat. Our advertisement is all about the toast bread. So, boy said, but I hit brown bread. So that is a toasted bread, right? So the boy said, do I have two? Okay, just one bite. Hmm, not body test like white bread. So the mom will tell how the toast bread 100 organic full meal and also there is a voice over which is explain on why you must eat a toast bread right so it baked okay. from 100 percent whole meal flour it's natural taste or that is an organic right okay so question is is it a good advert in your opinion so for me it is why because it is all about food right that is for the kids and for the adults food okay it helps to know what are the important thing about the breads okay Okay, which extract from Tasto do you think is the slogan? What do you think? Slogan. It's a good advert in your mm Mm-hmm. Okay. So, do we have listening strategy? Okay. Listening tasks, the instructions and questions usually give you some idea of the kind of topic and the type of language you're going to hear. Reading them carefully before you listen will help you to tune in. Okay? So here, read situation 1 to 4 below. What kind of language would you expect to hear in each situation? So language 4. A. Okay, please read A, B, C, D, E, and then we have our situation. Okay, go. Situation number one, what do you think is the answer? Please read first the situation number one. Agreeing and disagreeing. Okay. okay, what is that? A customer talking to a sales assistant in a shop. What is your answer? Agreeing and disagreeing. Giving direction. Narrating events. Complaining or persuading. Okay. A customer talking to a sales assistant in a shop. So what do you think? What is your answer? Just try only. No problem if you get a mistake as long as you learn. I don't know. What is your answer? Hmm. Okay, number two. Just try out then. What is your answer, number one? What is your answer, number one? Don't know anything. Okay, let's check.
Okay, so a customer talking to a sales assistant in a shop. So if there is a customer who talk for a sales assistant, what do you mean by that? So a situation is just like the customer will complain or the customer will ask something. Okay, but most of okay. all, if the customer talk to a sales assistant, the customer on that area is okay. complaining. If the sales assistant talk to a customer, so the sales assistant will guide for the customer. Okay, just remember that. Okay. Number two, an advertising executive in a business meeting. So what do you mean by that? So, that is... Okay. Agreeing. So, example, the advertising executive in the business meeting. So, if there is a business meeting, we have agreeing something, right? We have some also in every meeting, we have disagreeing one. So, agreeing and disagreeing is always there in a meeting. So, for persuading, meaning that you must do it because that is very good. Okay, you know that already. What is persuading? You do it for a good thing. Okay, so number three, mm -hmm. somebody telling a friend what happened earlier. Somebody telling a friend what happened earlier. Okay. Okay, so somebody telling a friend what happened earlier. So meaning that is narrating okay. event. So as just, as I said, that is a narrator. Tell something on what happened, the story, the event, or anything what happened to your life. They are always there to narrate. That is what we call maritas, right? That is narrating events. Okay, so somebody trying to follow a sat nav. What do you mean by that? That is a uh, giving direction, right? So you're always okay when you are in the road. You will always follow the directions, right? Okay. So now, now listen to the four situation. Match them with the sentence A. B below there is one extra sentence. So, okay, for example, not everyone is happy with the final decision. So, what is that? Okay. Sweet. So, not everyone is happy with the final decision. Please re uh, remember that that is what? That is what is this? We cannot see because we cannot hear something. So not everyone is happy with the final decision that is decision. One of the big uh, speaker was very unlucky. What do you mean by that? That is unbearable. Unbearable, right? This person finds it impossible to make a decision, still a decision. This person get confused and cross. So that is confusion, right? You're confused. Somebody needs help to solve the problem. So that is solve, right? So now let's move on. Complete the adjectives with the ending that you hear ed or ing. So go. What should you do? Number one. Annoying. Okay, write that. Nope. 
Okay, let's check. Okay, just remember that we have annoying, disappointed, confused, or confusing. It depends the story. Exhausted, very good, boring, amusing, satisfying. That That is not the spelling of the satisfying and the confusing, right? The confusing is right. The satisfying is not. So satisfied and then what is this? Mm, that is shock. You are shocked. So now let's move on. Let's have a role play so that you can understand. Okay. So how did it go? How did it go? No, but well for the start, I arrived late. Oh no, why? My taxi broke down, can you believe it? How awful, that's really bad luck. So I had to run to the interview, I look on my phone, I arrived Okay, just continue to read. So I had to run to the interview, a lock a mess with an arrive, right? Go. How annoying. You're your man, woman, go. Go, let's have a conversation. <laughs> And I answer the question very badly. Maybe you did okay. It's difficult to know. Again, what is that? Not this time. Okay. So please just continue. But you're great at your job. Um, but you are great at your job. Oh, maybe you did. Thanks, but I'm disappointed because I did badly in the interview. It's a shame. Good jobs in advertising are very hard to find. Again. Well, never mind. You'll get another chance. When one door closes, another opens. Okay, so next, please okay. read. At the 